hello students uh, in this question it's given to us for the system shown calculate velocity and acceleration of c the velocity and accelerations of a and b with respect to ground are marked so if you observe the diagram given here there are three blocks a b and c the block a has velocity of 2 meter per second in downward direction this is given in downward direction and the acceleration is 1 meter per second square in upward direction similarly velocity and acceleration for the block b is also given to us the velocity is 3 meter per second in upward direction and acceleration is also 2 meter per second square in upward direction we need to find the velocity and acceleration of the block c we can solve this question by tension work method let us assume the tension in the string connecting the blocks is t so this rope is having a tension t same rope is uh, going here so tension here is also t here it should also t because this is same rope so tension in the other end of the pulley uh, in this end should be 2t to balance the forces on the pulley so here tension to be 2t the uh, pulley the string which is having a tension t is going over this pulley and it is connected to block a so tension in this string is already assumed to be t now we have assumed tensions everywhere let us assume displacements of the blocks let us assume that the block a is moving up with displacement x the block c is moving up with displacement y and let us assume that b block is going down with displacement z now the work done by tensions on this block net work done by tensions on the block should be zero so work done by tension on the block a because tension is acting upward and the displacement is also assumed to be in upward direction so this work is positive and the work will be force into displacement tension into displacement this is the work done by tension on the block a for block b displacement is assumed to be in downward direction and tension is 2t in upward direction so its work will be negative of 2t into displacement which is z for block c tension is acting upward displacement is also assumed to be in upward direction this net work done by tension should going to uh, should be equal to zero if we solve this equation we will get expression as x plus y giving us 2z giving us 2z so this is the relations of the displacements of the block now if we differentiate this equation with time so we'll get relation in velocity which is dx by dt plus dy by dt should be equal to 2 times of d dt of d uh, d dt of z now dx by dt as x was the displacement of block a so this is the dx by dt this is going to be the velocity of block a plus dy by dt which was uh, y was the displacement of the block c so dy by dt will be the velocity of block c should equal to 2 times of d dt of z z is the displacement of block b so it should be 2 times of velocity of block z block c but uh the velocity's directions uh the should be the same as the direction of displacement which i have assumed the block a is given in question as going in downward direction but i have assumed its displacement to be in upward direction so i should put velocity with negative sign two velocity velocity of block a is given as 2 meter per second because it is in downward direction so i should put it put it with negative sign here velocity of block c is to be determined and velocity of block b velocity of block b uh, velocity of block b in question it is given as 3 meter per second square in upward direction but i have assumed b to be going b is going in downward direction so i should put this velocity as negative if we solve this expression we can get the velocity of the block c which is going out to be minus 6 plus 2 or it is going to be minus 4 meter per second i have assumed that block c is going up the velocity is negative it means the velocity of block c is in downward direction and it is of magnitude 4 meter per second similarly we can calculate the relation of acceleration if we differentiate the relation in velocity we will get relation in acceleration as acceleration of a plus acceleration of c is going to be two times of acceleration of b if i put the values of the accelerations of a and c acceleration of a is in upward direction of magnitude 1 meter per second square i i have also assumed displacement to be in upward direction so it should be positive positive 1 acceleration of c is to be determined acceleration of b is given given in upward direction but i have assumed its displacement in downward direction so i should put its acceleration with negative sign here so acceleration of c is going to be 
माइनस फोर माइनस वन और माइनस फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वायर बिकॉज दिस इज कमिंग आउट नेगेटिव सो द डायरेक्शन ऑफ एक्सेशन ऑफ सी इज अपोजिट टू द डायरेक्शन ऑफ डिस्प्लेसमेंट सो इट्स एक्सेशन शुड बी डाउनवर्ड डायरेक्शन ऑफ द मैग्नीट्यूड फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वायर सो वी नीडेड टू फाइंड द वेलासिटीज एंड एक्सेशन ऑफ द ब्लॉक सी सो दिस आर वेलासिटी ऑफ ब्लॉक सी एंड मैग्नीट्यूड इज फोर मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वायर and its direction is downward and acceleration of block c is 5 meter per second square it is also in downward direction velocity should be 4 meter per second thank you